Hello, Jose. Hello, teacher. How are you? How are you? I'm fine. Fine, good. We were missing you yesterday. Te estuvimos extrañando el día de ayer. I'm fine and I'm fine. Gracias, no pude. Sí, así lo, así lo leímos. Siempre, eh, eso es importante siempre que lo, que lo reporte también a inglés corporativo. Para que no haya problemas. Sí, sí, el caso de ayer este, tuve inconvenientes con la familia. Se me perdió la conexión de José. Medio lo escuché. Hello, Luz, how are you? Hello. Hello, hello. <risa> Se me quedó perdido, José, ahí a medias. No, 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 se nos quedó ahí José a media. Creo ah. que es, es su conexión, la, la mala. Ah, ya volvió. Se nos perdió, José. Se nos perdió, se nos perdió. ¿Qué pasó? Ahí está ya de vuelta, José. José, se le trabó su internet, ya no le oí nada. No creo que todavía tiene unos cuantos issues ahí de conexión. Sí, se me desconectó. Today is going to be a private class only for Luz. Se va a tener clase privada, Lucita. Let's work. Okay, let's work then. Jose is back. So, let's see. Let's work today. Well, it's a pleasure to have you here. Welcome back. Welcome, Jose. Jose se me va, se me viene. Let's work. Okay. We're going to work a little bit on the practice of third person, and today we're going to start working on the daily routines. So we are going to work on daily routines. We are going to work on sentences. It is going to be a nice day of classes today. Okay, so let's start by uh, working on this. I am going to send you this to you because we're going to use it, okay? So welcome to all the ones that are connecting. Welcome uh, to Joanita, welcome to Steven. Welcome Mr. Jose and Luz who were already here. Welcome to your class. It's a pleasure to have you here. Well, I am going to send you a picture on WhatsApp because we're going to use it later, okay? La vamos a usar despuesito, pero se las tengo que enviar ya para que la tenga. Okay? Here it is. Okay. We're going to use that picture later, okay? Esa foto la vamos a usar después, pero que ya les quede. It is on your WhatsApp. Okay, and we are going to start today by uh, practicing a couple of questions, right? We are going to do a couple of sentences to start the class. 
How was your day, my dear students? Cuéntenme, ¿cómo estuvo su día? ¿Qué hicieron? Pesado. <laughs> Pesado. What did you do? ¿Qué hicieron? Cuéntenme. Only work, work, work. It is not possible. Huh? Oh, really? It is your last day for vacation. Oh, o sea que sus vacaciones empezaron ahora. Qué chivísimo. Todos tienen vacaciones. Sí. Ah, qué envidia. O sea que desde mañana hasta cuándo? Lunes. Hasta el otro lunes. Sí. Sí, la envidia ha entrado al grupo definitivamente. Sí. Ok. Hey, José, hasta que lo veo completo. No nos quieren en la planta por eso. No, pero qué chivísimo. José nunca lo había visto completo. Solo le había visto en la frente. <ríe> Hoy conocimos a José. Bueno, yo. Ustedes ya lo conocen. No. no conocen a José. Nunca se han visto en vivo. Sinceramente, creo que solo he visto a dos personas de todos los que se conectan. A los demás nunca los he visto. Júntense un día para almorzar. Creo que será... Así debería ser, juntémonos todos. Pero es que no sé si estamos cerca por eso. Ajá. Estamos Bien. en diferentes plantas y no sé. Eh... Si sí salen a la misma hora a almorzar y cosas así. Algún Exacto. día, o oh, temprano todos y díganle, hey, mañana pupusas ahí donde la fulana, ahí sacan alguna pupusería famosa. Porque de aquí al lado de, de donde yo trabajo, eh, solo he visto eh, esta... Tatiana, está uh -huh. Cristian, que está cerca también, a él sí ya lo conozco y nos llevamos bien. Eh, Joana. Uh -huh. eh, Leti. Ok. Es, sí, se, y quiero ver, no me acuerdo la otra chica cómo se llama, que trabajamos de cierta manera aquí, aquí cerca eh, en La Paz. Oh, ok. Sí, quizás han de estar en diferentes plantas. Pero mire qué uh -huh. chivísimo que tienen el chance al menos de conocerse unos con otros. That's so nice. Pero sí que qué chistoso que 11 días casi juntos y solo le había visto la frente a José. Es que la también estoy en diferente escenario porque hoy, ahorita estoy aquí donde mi mamá. Ah, ok. Por That's eso es cool. que... Sí, porque en su casa está en la hamaca y ya la vi la hamaca un día y bien chivo. No, no se ve. Okay. Bueno, la tiene no, la par, no sé. Quizás está cerca. No, eh. es, es la cortina de la ventana. La que oh, ok, ya ve. Es que el universo no nos deja ver esos detalles. Sí, lo que pasa es que me encierro en el cuarto porque mis niñas están. Papi, que yo quiero estar contigo. Papi, yo quiero estar contigo. <risa> It happens, right? It's very normal with the kids. Well, what a pleasure, right? What a pleasure to see you. Hello, Leti, Tati, Alma Dalila. Hoy no tiene su boxeador ahí encima, Alma Dalila. Ayer estaba... ¡Está jugando! Ayer veía que Alma participando con él. Yo también es, es así, pegadito. Ay, Pero ahora está jugando. De ah, hecho, está ahí. Está ahí. Ahí lo tienen quieto. Eh. Hola. Está bueno que esté quieto. Ya lo vamos a poner a aprender inglés también. <laughs> well, it is a big pleasure to have you here. And today we are going to start the night with a little game. We're going to play a little game. And for this one, I know you know it. It's going to be uh, good for spelling, right? We're going to practice spelling with this game. And it is going to be a nice practice for, for vocabulary. Okay, so we're going to have one, two, three, four, five. Okay. I am going to start by adding different spaces. Right, we're going to add different spaces here. Where are we going? Hey, 
And here we go. Ta -da! I know you know the game, right? Okay. There you go. I need you to give me letters. If you don't know, if you the letter is not here, I am going to draw a piece of the hangman, okay? Es to se llama hangman. Okay, hangman. Or cow. Hangman. Don't kill the person, please. Give me letters. Vowels or consonants. Go ahead. Only four vowels. letters. Okay. Vowels. Okay, vowels or consonants. No importa. Es sea vocales o consonantes. Joana? E. 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 No. Oh. There is no E. Another one. F. F. Uy. I know, people. F. No. Another one. A. A. One. Letter. P. P. Like potato. Letter. Uh -huh. Letter. T. E? T of tomato. No, D. D. E. I know D. Ouch. Letter. Letter. Vamos, digan más letras. O oh, vocales, consonantes, no sé. M. M. Ay, the M. <laughs> This is the M, my lonely friend, the M. M. No N. 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 Like Natalie. Ay, yes. le vamos a poner la pita ya, tomo. Letter. 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 Ajá. Sí. Sí. No, sí. Sí. Sí, of what? Ay, 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 Le vamos a hacer un nudo, papá, todavía para no matarlo tan pronto. Una canillita le queda. Letter. A. H. Ok, R o H. R. R. The Rose. Yes. Chan, chan, chan. Ta. Todavía le vamos a hacer los ojitos, va, muerto. Ja. One more. One more. It's a vowel. Okay, I will help you. It's a vowel. Um, H. It's a vowel. It's a vocal. A ver. O. 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 S. S. Yes, very good, very good. So, no moriste, hijo, estás vivo. <laughs> It's alive, yay. So, what is the meaning of soap? Jabón, jabón, jabón. Right there you have. Very good. Now let's do another one. The first one, soap. Let's see. This one, letter. One, two, three, four, five. Go ahead. Five letters. Cinco letras. One, two, three, four, five. Uh-huh. 
¡Ey! 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 ¡Sí! ¡Sí! ¡My goodness! Letters. L. L. Chan, chan, chan. B. B. Of banana. Yes. No. <laughs> oh. H. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Me dijeron O. Oh, no. H. Hell no. Another one. Let it. T. T. Of tomato. Yes. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. P. P. Of peanut. Yes. Which one? S. S. E. 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 Very good. Space. Very nice. There you have a space. A space. Good. Hey, you know, for young, you know, At least they didn't kill you that much. The last one. The last letter. It's going to be wait, 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 wait. There you go. Huh? J. J. Oh. Empezamos violentos. A. A. A, B, C. No. O. O. Oh. oh, no. D. B. I know. L. E. L. Yes. L. M. N. M. Of N or M. N of Natalie or M. M. N. M of Funky. No. A. B. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Which one lose? A. A or E? No, A. A. The ABC ya la dijeron. La A ya la dijeron. ¿Cuál otra? I. I. Yes. I. 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 P. P. No. Ahora vamos a hacer la pitita aquí, mi amigo. Sí. Sí. Sí, de casa. Para eso, yes. Uh, no, we don't have the. Wait, 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 wait. Can you connect the walkie, Alex? Chen, chen, chen. No. There is no C. E. E. S. H. M. 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 G. English. G. Very good job. You did it. Hey, you didn't kill anybody. Very good job. Very good job. So you didn't kill him. He was very happy.
There you go. Fantastic job, my dear class, right? Something as simple as hangman makes you think about English, right? Algo tan sencillo como el ahorcado los hace pensar en inglés. That's so cool. Definitely. It is really cool. So, we are going to work a little bit on uh, some sentences today, okay? We're going to work on some sentences and we are going to work a little bit on this. Just give me one second. Okay, here we go. We're going to start with some questions today. Let me share my screen so we can check on the questions. Here we go. Here, we have a couple of questions, right? We have a couple of questions and we are going to work on them right now, right? We are going to work on the first seven questions, okay? Seven questions, we are going to work on this I need you please to check on the questions. Check on them because you are going to work on this with me. Tell me the question. Imagine if you are asking me the question. Si ustedes me están haciendo la pregunta a mí, ¿cómo sería la pregunta? Esta es la primera pregunta. Where does he or she live? Si me la hicieran a mí, ¿cómo preguntarían esto? ¿Cómo me hicieran la pregunta si la pregunta fuera referida a mí? Teacher, where? Where, where do, 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 uh -huh. where thou, thou, no, where do, where do, she, where do you live? Where do you, porque me están preguntando a mí, where do you live? Teacher, where, where do, do you live? Okay, and I am going to tell you. Well, I live in San Salvador, in the center of San Salvador. And how are you going to answer? ¿Cómo responderían aquí? ¿Cómo redactarían su respuesta? Si yo les contesto, I live in San Salvador. So you say, she lives in San Salvador in the center of the city. And there you have the answer, right? How do you ask the next question? ¿Cómo me preguntarían lo siguiente? Esta es la pregunta base para ustedes, pero ¿cómo se la hacen a otra persona? Select teacher, what time? Miren el primer ejemplo. Where do you live? La segunda. What time? What time? What time do you? Do you? Uh -huh. What time do you usually go, go to, to bed? bed? What time do you usually go to bed? Háganme la pregunta. Teacher. Teacher, what time do you do you do you usually go to bed? I go to bed at 11. I go to bed at 11. ¿Cómo me reportan la respuesta? I go to bed at 11. ¿Cómo reportan la respuesta? She goes, she goes to bed at 11. At 9. At, at 9. Ay, qué galán fue. He will be like, bye students, <laughs> at nine. <laughs> she goes to bed at 11. The next question, how do you make the next question? What time does he or she usually get up in the morning? Sigan el mismo ejemplo. What time? What time do you? Do you? usually get up in, in the morning. morning what time do you usually get up in the morning do i get up at five in the morning ¿Cómo respondemos? 
Si usted me está reportando lo que yo estoy respondiendo. I get up at five in the morning. She get up. She gets up get, at five a.m. She gets up at five a.m. Number four. Es el mismo patrón. Number four. What do you do you watch on TV? Very good job. What do you watch on TV? What do you watch on TV? Um, let me see. I like to watch comedy movies. I like to watch comedy movies. She likes, she likes she likes to watch comedy movies. Very good job. She likes to watch comedy movies. Right? You can say comedy movies, action movies, horror movies, um, I don't know, romantic movies, right? You have all the different options. And if you say, for example, I like to watch news, las noticias. I like to watch series. I like to watch anime. I like to watch soap operas. What are soap operas? Marimar, Maria La del Barrio, La Dueña, La No Dueña, everything, right? So those are soap operas. Or you can say, for example, what else? Ah, sports. Okay, sports. Those are the answers that you can give. Where, where, where do you, where do you, you study English? Where do study you study English? English? I study English at English Corporativo. Porque tengo que, tengo que estudiar para enseñar. El que deja de aprender, de, le quito el derecho de que enseñe. I study English at English Corporativo. He studies, he studies English, English at, at English Corporativo. At, ah, it's a, okay, it's in Spanish anyway. At English, English, English corporative. Corp corporative English. <laughs> uh, she studies English at English Corporativo. Very good. The next one. How do you make the next one? Aquí no comienza con WH. Si se fijan, comienza con el auxiliar. Do you... Do you... Usually fail tests? Do you usually fail tests? Do you usually fail tests or... Or do you usually pass tests? Ha. Huh. I usually pass the test. I usually pass the test. So you say, she usually passes the test. Okay, she usually passes the test. What about the next one? Where? Do you eat lunch? Where do you eat lunch? I eat lunch at my office. Hello. <laughs> I eat lunch at my office. She eat lunch. Lunch at. at The office. At the office, pero la respuesta que le di fue, I eat lunch at my office. ¿Cómo lo cambiamos a tercera persona? She eats lunch at her. Her. Very good. Hair. She eats lunch at her office. office. Okay. Allá sola, sola, insolita. What about the next one? 
when when do you when do you exercise i exercise every day porque el edificio tiene tres plantas y un montón de grado. i exercise every day so you say she exercise exercises Exer oh my god exercises every day and there you go right that's the form right that's the form you ask with something but you report another thing si se fijan ustedes estaban haciendo preguntas en segunda persona y las respuestas obviamente para reportarlas tenían que ir en tercera persona ok porque en segunda persona le van a contestar en primera. Eso es como el, el del inglés, vea. Pero hago preguntas en segunda persona, me responden en primera y yo reporto en tercera. Si usted ya va a pasar el chambre, ya dice, ah, no, she eats lunch at her office. Imagínese que yo le diga, hey, where does teacher Nati eat lunch? Ah, she eats lunch at her office. Porque no estamos hablando ni de ti ni de mí, sino que de alguien más. Si les digo yo, por ejemplo, hey, ¿a dónde vive Teacher Nati? Where does she live? Where does she live? ¿Dónde vive Teacher Nati? She lives in San Salvador. Specifically, in the center, in in the center, center of the city. Of the city. ¿Han visto el parque donde sale a bailar la gente? Ahí vivo yo. No, mentira. It's here in San Salvador. Hey, what time does Teacher Nati go to bed? She what? goes to bed she, uh -huh. at 11. Very PM. good job. What time does Teacher Nati get up in the morning? She get. She get. ¿cómo, cómo se dice? She gets up. She gets up, up. Five at 5 a.m. And let me see. Ustedes me van a contestar en tercera persona como que no estoy hablando de ustedes. Edwin, ¿a qué hora se levanta Edwin? What time does Edwin get up? So me contesta. He gets up, aunque seas tú mismo. ¿verdad? What time does Edwin get up? He gets up. At 5 a.m. Oh, how do you know? Hmm? Four okay. Atrapada. Ya <laughs> este escucho, Edwin, eh, pero es que Catherine nos dio la respuesta. Sí, me, bueno. me llega Catherine, me llega eso, me llega. <laughs> Aquí todos nos divertimos, Catherine. Era, era chiste. Oh, ahí solo divertimos. Edwin, what time do you get up? She head, she head up. What time at, do you get up? At 4 a.m. At 4 a.m. Oh my God. Ya ves, Catherine, más temprano se levanta. No, Catherine, todavía te estaba regalando una hora de sueño, fíjate. At 5, but you say at 4. That was good. Joanna, what does Joanna watch on TV? I watch TV. No, Joanna, estamos hablando de la Johanna. No conoces a la Johanna. She watches. Uh, she, watches she watches at uh, 5 p.m. No, listen to the question. What does Joanna watch on TV? What does Joanna watch on TV? She like. José, ajá, ¿qué le gusta ver a la Ivana? Cuénteme. Eh, sport. Oh, watch she, she likes. Comedy. Ah, she likes to watch sports, ¿cierto, Ivana? Yes, yes. Ok, ok, atrapado de nuevo. ¿Cómo? 
It's because you are very good friends and you know each other, right? Ustedes se conocen, son amigos. Bueno, por eso. What do you watch on TV? ¿Qué es lo que te gusta ver en la tele? You say, she watches what? She watches. Joanita. Uh, she watches a movie horror. Movie horror. Ahí puse yo comedy movies. Entonces sería horror. Horror movie. Horror movies. Very good. Ilse. Ilse. Where, where does Ilse study English? She mm -hmm. study English. Mm -hmm. Do you have the answer there? Es la misma para todos. Uh, Ad inglés corporativo. Very good job. Let's see. Tatiana. Tatiana. What time does Tatiana get up in the morning? What time does Tatiana get up in the morning? Perdía la Tati. Se levanta tan temprano que se puede dormir. Tati, te perdimos. Ha vuelto la Tati. Hola, Tati. What time do you get up in the morning? So you say she. Juan está preguntando, Tisha, disculpe que tengo problemas con el internet. What time does Tatiana get up in the morning? She get up at 5 a.m. At 5 a.m. Very good job. Let's see. Luz. Where does Luz live? Where does Luz live? Number one. The microphone's really not there. She, 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 she lives. She lives. She lives. She lives, in, she lives in... Hayake. In Hayake. Good. Very good. She lives in Hayake. Very nice. Jose, what time does Jose go to bed? What time does Jose go to bed? He goes to bed at uh, 10 p.m. At 10 p.m. Good. He goes to bed at 10 p.m. Very nice. Let me see. I am missing che, che, che. Alma Dalila. What time does Alma get up? She gets, get, she gets up and gets at um, 5 at 5 at 5 a.m. Very good job, right? There you go. You see, these are the examples. Leticia, te pregunté. Me falta Janet también. Leticia González, what does Leticia watch on TV? What does Leticia watch on TV? She likes to watch um. Um, series, um, um, no sé cómo se dice, um, dramas, digamos. Dramas, dramas, o dramas. Uh -huh. No, dramas. Dramas, ok, dramas. Drama, drama. Ok, ok, drama series, drama series. Janet, where does Janet study English? Where does Janet study English? Aquí está la respuesta. Where does Janet study English? 
She's a student English. Uh, it's in Spanish, no? At English. El Corporativo. At English Corporativo, right? She studies. Studies English at English Corporativo. <laughs> She studies English at English Corporativo. Very good job, my dear <clears throat> students. Very nice job working on this. So, you have this on your WhatsApp, okay? Les envié esta imagen a su WhatsApp. Ahí la tienen. What are you going to do with this, okay? With this one, este es un, un challenge bastante grande, pero yo sé que lo vamos a lograr. Vamos a trabajar en grupos de tres, okay? And what we are going to do is the following. I need you to transform the paragraph into third person. Vamos a transformar todo este párrafo, todo este párrafo, en tercera persona. Vamos a empezar juntos y de ahí lo van a terminar ustedes. Okay? And it says, John's daily routine. ¿Qué vamos a identificar primero? Las oraciones completas hasta el primer punto. Okay? John's daily routine is a little boring, but he like it. Aquí está el error porque decía solo like, entonces tiene que ser likes, okay? The next one, he usually in the morning. ¿Cuál es el problema aquí? ¿Cuál sería el problema en esa oración? Get, get up. Get. Ah. ¿Cómo tendría que ser? Gets, gets up. up, right? He usually gets up at six, at about six or six thirty in the morning. After his alarm clock. What is the problem here? Wake. After his alarm clock, wake. ¿Qué tendría que ser? Wake. Wakes him up. Okay. There we have the next one. First, you say first he brushes brushes his teeth and shaves shaves and Washes, washes, washes his face, his face. Okay? okay, that's what you are going to do. Okay, ustedes van a seguir. Okay, you are going to write the verbs on your notebook. Si lo pueden hacer en ir anotando los verbos que van cambiando en su cuaderno, that's perfect. Okay, si lo pueden cambiar ahí en la imagen, perfect. Okay, that's what you are going to do. La tienen en su WhatsApp. La imagen. Transformar. ¿Cómo fue la pregunta? ¿Cómo? You, are you are going to transform the paragraph into third person. Van a transformar el párrafo. Si se fijan, aquí tenía errores de tercera persona que no estaban marcados en los verbos y los hemos ido cambiando. ¿Ok? Eso es lo que van a hacer ustedes exactamente. ¿Ok? Voy a entrar a los grupos a verlos nada más. Hoy no les voy a ayudar. Sorry. It sounds horrible. Se oye horrible, pero no. It's not like that. It's not that bad. Okay. We have only 11 people. People. Yes. And we're going to... Okay, we have it here. And I am going to give you for this activity, we're going to have 15 minutes. Okay, tenemos 15 minutos para esta actividad. Si necesitamos más, le doy más, más minutos. Don't worry. Go ahead. Little groups of three and four. It's a challenge. Go ahead. Excellent job. So let's wait for them to set up in the different groups. And we are going to go and check how they are doing.
Este, tenemos 15 minutos, partiendo de ahorita, 15. Eh, va, eh, eh, quedó el get. Dries. Dries and go downstairs to have breakfast. With his family, he always has juice. Oh, no. This is and go decide to have breakfast with his family. Uh, ¿Alguna de ustedes? ¿Alguna de ustedes está trabajando en computadora? No. No. Todos están en teléfono. Pero alguno de ustedes puede compartir pantalla. Eso. Por si alguno lo tiene este, en, en el teléfono y lo puede compartir, le pueden dar en compartir pantalla para que todos vayan viendo. Esa es una opción. Hey, que se nos hizo la Leti. Uy, yo. <risa> Qué yuca el ejercicio, teacher salud. <risa> ok, ahí viene, ya, ya vi. Ya me voy a ir aquí. Pregando. Yeah, I will come back. There you go. Si alguien lo quiere compartir. Uh -huh. Sí. Hello. Hola, Edwin. Ah, Edwin está en el teléfono, por eso no, no le sale la cámara. Sí. No, bueno, sí, pero es que. Cuesta, sí. No, I know, I know. Eh, Tatiana, ¿tú estás en computadora? Sí. Ok, puedes compartir pantalla si quieres para que puedan ver todos el párrafo y vayan trabajando ahí. Vaya, ahorita. Ajá, ya les di permiso a todos para que puedan compartir pantalla. Y así lo pueden ir viendo todos. No sé si me puedo salir y volver a... Ahí está, volvimos a ver algo. complicado, pues, que yo no Oh, ok. ¿Y con qué te conectas? Oh, ok. ¿La ya está donde compartir pantalla, Tati? Sí, ahorita. Es que no la tenía ahí. Ah, ok, okay, okay. En la compra. Ahorita ya. Ok, perfecto. Voy a ir a visitar al tercero. Ya vuelvo. Mm -hmm. Entonces, tú, tú, ha. His family. Pero es que no puede ser ni get ni wish. ¿A dónde está? <ríe> ¿A dónde está? Eh, después de donde dice wash his face. Ah, ok, permítame, solo voy a meter a la letra aquí al grupo. Que se me salió. Ahí está. Ok, where, where, where you are here. Then, okay, da, da, da. ¿a dónde van? Wash his face and then they said then then he he get Ajá, ¿cuál sería el uh, verbo ahí para cambiar? Ajá. Uh, <ríe> que eso that, no se Solo le agregamos la, la S a get. Yes. Get. Ajá. Porque aquí vaya. Vaya, les explico. Tenemos la oración completa. Una oración completa es hasta donde esté el punto. Hasta donde esté el siguiente punto. Family. 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 ¿eh? Aquí tenemos todo esto. ¿Cuál es el sujeto de esta oración? El sujeto. ¿De quién están hablando? Then he gets dressed. Ajá. So you are talking about he. Este es el sujeto. ¿Cuáles verbos tenemos? Tenemos el verbo. Y aquí se le puede hacer con otro color. Aquí tenemos. Tenemos get dressed, 
Tenemos el verbo go. Go downstairs. Tenemos el verbo. Eh, hasta ahí. Then he gets dressed and go downstairs to have breakfast with his family. Esos son los dos verbos principales. Se viste y baja a desayunar. ¿Cómo cambiamos el primero? Get. Gets. Get, le falta la S. Get. Get. ¿Y el uh -huh. otro? Goes. 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 Ok. okay. Y ahí lo tiene. He gets dressed and goes downstairs to have breakfast with his family. Ahí está. Esto no cambia porque esto es un infinitivo. ¿eh? Esto es un infinitivo. Eso no cambia. La siguiente. ¿Cuál es la siguiente oración? Y hasta aquí, está el, hasta aquí está el punto. Juice, orange juice. He always has juice, cereal, and lots of fruits. ¿Hay un error ahí? Si no hay error, seguimos con la siguiente. No, no hay error. He always has. ¿Por qué? Porque tenemos has, que ya has. está en tercera persona. Entonces, mm -hmm. ese no es un error. He always has juice, cereal, and lots of fruit. Entonces, eso está correcto. Seguimos con la otra. That's him in the picture with his wife. ¿Hay algún error en esta oración? Eh, no. No, right? That's him in the picture with his wife. ¿Por qué? Porque ahí no hay tercera persona ni nada. Nos están indicando que es él en la foto. The next one. ¿Hasta dónde llega la siguiente oración? He takes a bus to work. Drive. He takes a bus to work. Drive. Aquí no hay punto. And es como... And... Llega hasta A, B for eight. eight. Ahí tienen esa oración que es bien larga. Entonces, ¿cómo la cambiamos? Primero identificamos el sujeto. Tenemos he. ¿Cuáles el. verbos tenemos? Take. Take. Ajá. Take. And booth. Uh -huh. Entonces... Eh, agregamos a Taike la S. Ah, he, he takes a bus to yeah. work because he. ¿Hay algún error aquí si tenemos auxiliar y verbo? Um, tenemos el auxiliar doesn't. Y cuando tenemos el auxiliar, ¿qué pasa con el verbo? Se cambia. Mm, no Así cambia. Es. No. It doesn't like. Cuando hay auxiliar doesn't or does, ahí el verbo ya se queda normal. Entonces aquí está ah. correcto. He doesn't like to drive. And he always... ¿Cuál es el problema con arrive? He always... Right. Arrives. Right with the S. Arrives at his office before eight. Okay, so there you go. Ya las encaminé un montón. Hagan ustedes la última parte. Aquí va. Identifiquen hasta dónde llega la siguiente oración. Hasta aquí. Okay. Siga. Pero lo único que cuando yo me voy se va el párrafo conmigo porque ya no sigue compartiendo. Continue on your on your cell phone, okay? Okay. Now, okay. now you got it, right? Hoy ya la dejé bien encaminada, así que sí. Because he doesn't like, he mm -hmm. doesn't like to drive. Ahí estamos bien. He doesn't like to drive. And aquí hasta la madre le dice, and he always arrives. Arrives. Always, nada más. Arise, arise. Always, always es un adverbio de frecuencia, no lo cambiamos. Pero después. Arise, arise. Arise, arise. Arise, arise. Arise, arise. Arise, arise. Arise, ¿A dónde van? 
Eh, aquí. Aquí. Hey. ¿A dónde? Aquí donde dice he has. Ah, okay, okay. Boys. He has two boys. That's okay. That's okay because has is third person. Okay. Continue. What is the next one? Thomas, who is six years old, and Patrick, who is eight. Eso no lo van a cambiar porque está correcto. They sería. They es segunda persona plural. They eat dinner. Cambiamos para they, we, o solo para he, she, it. Only for he, she, and it. Only for he, she, and it. They eat dinner together. This is correct. In their dining room at around six. And after that, aquí sí ya están hablando de he. He spends. Aquí de he takes a Okay. Continue. I will come back in a second. Ya vuelvo. Sí. Sí. La otra sería he has two boys. Eso está bien, he has two boys. Thomas, who is six years old, and Patrick, who is eight. They eat dinner together in their dining room at around six. It, it no lleva. No, porque ahí es they. They eat, ahí está bien. They eat dinner together in their dining room at around six. And after that, he is expensive. Marcalo ahí le Ahí está marcando. Ah, Spence. Time with his wife and kids at home. Programs together in addiction to for Exercise. No, sería. He does. He does. He does. He does. He does. He does. He 
Exceso no. es... No es verbo. Solo tú. Quitas. He does exercise. That's good. Exercise. Das is the one that you change. Yes, yes, yes. He does exercise in the evening. Yes, yes. Aquí está. Para seguir llegaría la otra oración que sería la siguiente que es so so he can can. Okay, students have been working a lot on their breakout rooms. We're going to bring them back and we're going to check the exercise together. Hello, 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 hello students. We are missing only two minutes for this exercise. So please start keeping and saving your work. Terminamos en dos minutos. Es que Ron, creo que, si no me equivoco, es dormitorio. Sí, eso es. Y Aaron... Donde dice Aaron. Ajá, ajá, estoy aquí en Chips. Ajá, Aaron. ¿Qué es Aaron? Llevaríamos eh, la S ahí. ¿A dónde? No, in that one, no. In that one, for example, it says, let's see, eh, it says, They eat dinner together in their dining room, en la mesa del comedor, at around six, ¿ok? Aquí no cambiamos nada porque estamos hablando de qué tipo de sujeto. De ellos. De, de ellos. Ok, y cambiamos nada más para he, she, and it. They eat dinner together in the dining room at six. And after that, ahí sí, ¿qué sujeto tenemos? And after that... He. He, uh -huh. he, 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 spends, spends, con ese. con ese, time with his wife and kids at home, y ahí se acaba. They really enjoy watching their favorite TV programs together, cambiaríamos la siguiente, no, because it is with, they, 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 Um, no. Right? In the next one, we don't change because it's with they, right? It's with they. Excellent. So let's continue then. The next one says, in addition, two or three times a week, he. Ahí tenemos he. Entonces, ¿cuál sería el verbo que sigue? Dos. He does, very good. He does he exercise does. in the evening. So he can stay strong and healthy. Después de can, no cambiamos, right? He can. Ese se queda normal. He, ese sí, he thinks that this is very important. Okay? Finish with the last ones. We are going to go back. Vamos a regresar ya a la sala principal y vamos a revisar todo. Okay?
Welcome. Welcome back. Hello. Hello, Edwin. Hello, everybody. Welcome. Welcome back. Let's call the attendance and then we continue. Hola. Les voy a pasar lista y después vamos a hacer el ejercicio todos. Let's see. Alma Dalila. I am present, teacher. Thank you. Alma Xiomara, Alba Leticia, González. Present teacher. Antonio José. He's working. Cristian Mauricio. Edwin Steven. Eric No. Evelyn Janet Sarabia. Present teacher. Present teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see. Thank you very much. Ok, Janet Tatiana. Sí, por solo tres. Present teacher. José Heriberto Reyes, thank you. José Oscar Flores. Let's continue with Josué David, que no está tampoco. Catherine Alejandra Juárez. Poco. Catherine Elizabeth Romero. Tampoco. Catherine Lisbeth Solórzano. Present teacher. Thank you. Leticia Magdalena Ortiz. Eh, no vino la Leti Ortiz. ¿Qué sucede? Eh, Ilse Marlene. Present teacher. Thank you. Luz de Jesús. Present. Melvin, no. Rosa Margarita, no. Rosa María, no. And Joanna Mariela. Present teacher. Very good job. Thank you. So let's continue. We're going to solve the exercise together. In this exercise, what you were supposed to do is to change the verbs. Let's check on the exercise. Yeah, it's right here. Okay. What is the most important thing when you work on an exercise like this? Lo más importante cuando tienen un ejercicio como este es identificar las oraciones. The first sentence that we have here. ¿Hasta dónde llega la siguiente oración? Hasta el punto. Okay. He always has juice, cereal, and lots of fruits. Is there a problem with that sentence? ¿Hay algún problema con esta oración o está correcto? It's correct. It's correct, right? He always has. That's correct. The next one, that's him in the picture with his wife. Is that correct? Yes, right? Yes. The next one, he... And esta oración es larga porque llega hasta aquí. ¿Cuál es el sujeto de esta oración? He, right? He is the subject. What are the verbs? ¿Cuáles son los verbos? Take. Take. take and work. No. And and like. Like and. Dry. Okay. okay, let me explain. In this one, when we have. He take a bus. Is that correct? No. He take a bus. Esta de aquí. ¿Qué le hace falta? Bus. He takes. He takes, takes. Right? He takes a bus to work. Aquí no le cambiamos porque este es un infinitivo seguido de tú. Después de tú va un verbo normal. He takes a bus porque el verbo principal es take. He takes a bus to work because... He doesn't. he doesn't like. ¿Qué pasa cuando tenemos auxiliar doesn't? 
El verbo no. Okay. No cambia, right? He okay. doesn't like, eso está correcto. He doesn't like to drive. ¿Qué sería to drive en este caso? Les acabo de decir que es un infinitivo como to work. Eso va normal. He always arrives at his office before eight. Arrives. Okay? Arrives. Ustedes vayan chequeando que han hecho los mismos cambios. The next one. Five o'clock is his favorite time of the day because he finished work and hurry back to the hasta aquí. Right, that's the next sentence, right? What changes did you make on that one? ¿Qué cambios le hicieron a esa oración? Uh -huh. Finishes. He finishes. Yes. What is another one that you change? ¿Qué otro cambiaron? All these verbs need to change, okay? Todos estos tenían que ser cambiados. We have five o'clock is his favorite time of the day because he finishes work and hurries back home and sees his wife. Okay, esos tres tenían que cambiar porque eran tres verbos en una misma oración que siempre afectaban a él. He finished work, he hurries back, and sees his wife. You have three different verbs. Okay? He has two boys. ¿Eso está correcto o incorrecto? Correct. It's correct, right? He has two boys. Thomas, who is six years old, and Patrick, who is eight. Okay? No change, because you are not talking about anybody, right? The next sentence, they eat dinner together in the dining room at around six. And after that, he spends time with his wife and kids at home. Hasta aquí llega la oración. What changes did you make? Kids. Oh. Ah, so you say, they, they, they eat dinner. Cambiamos esto, estamos hablando de they. No. Ajá. So they eat dinner together in the dining room at around six. Está bien. And after that, he spends. He spends, right? He spends with S. Time with his wife and kids at home. Muy bien. Continue. They really enjoy. They. No cambiamos, right? They really enjoy watching their favorite TV programs together. Esta está correcta porque es con they. In addition, two or three times a week, he does. does. He does exercise in the evening. So, he can stay strong and healthy. En el verbo can, no se cambia. Can, can es uno de los verbos más amigables de todo el idioma inglés. Después de can, todos los verbos van normales. Y can es el mismo para I, you, he, she, they, we. No cambia. Can es el más amigable de todos los verbos. Porque decimos, I can cook, you can cook, she can cook, they can cook. And it doesn't change. Right? Que todos fueran como can there. <laughs> Hashtag seamos como que. The next one. He he thinks that this is very important. Finally, at about nine thirty, he what is the change? Goes. 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 He goes to bed and Read. reads for a while and then falls asleep. 
Sure, see. some people think his daily routine is a little boring, but on weekends and holidays, he loves. He loves to fly airplanes for fun. It's his favorite hobby. Okay, so that's the paragraph. Sé que fue un ejercicio largo y complicado. There you have it. Okay, there you have it with all the changes. I am going to send it to you right now. Se los envío ahorita con todos los cambios para que lo puedan comparar. Give me a second. There we go, Mr. John. Give me just a quick second to send it to you. And we're going to read and practice reading. Okay, we're going to practice reading with this. And, okay. Let me just open WhatsApp to send you the picture so you can have it. You can have the two versions, the correct and the incorrect. There you have it on WhatsApp. Perfect. So after this, we are going to do the following. Let me share again. Vamos a compartir de nuevo. Ya lo tienen en su WhatsApp. Ya les llegó la versión nueva, correcta. Perfect. So we are going to do the following. We are going to do the following. I am going to assign different colors to this. Okay. This is the first one. Yellow, number one. Then we have green. Then we are going to have red. Okay, then we are going to have light blue. I have one, two, three, four. And the last one is going to be pink. Okay. Five. There you go. We have five different colors. We are going to practice reading. One, two, three, four, five. Let's see. We have five different colors. And we have Edwin Steven. Edwin Steven, you are number one. Number one. Ilse Marlene, number two. Tatiana, number three. Joanna, number four. Catering number five, okay? Then Luz, you are number one. Jose, number two. Janet, number three. Alma, number four. And Leticia, number five, okay? Edwin, Ilse, Tatiana, Joanna, and Catering, you are the first ones. Después va Luz, Jose, Janet, Alma, y Leti. We have five different colors. Tenemos cinco colores distintos. ¿Cuál es el primer color? Yellow. Then green. Then red. Then light blue. And then pink. Identify your color. Edwin, what is your color? Yellow. Yellow. Ilse? Green. Tatiana? Red. Red. Joanna? Light blue. And Catherine? Pink. Pink. Very good. Practice your color. Luz? Yellow. Yellow. Jose? Green. Green. Janet? What is your color? Blue. No. Number three? Red. 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 Alma Dalila? Light. Light blue and Leticia. Pink. Pink. Okay. Pink. Practice your color. Practice your color. If you have questions, let me know. Si tienen preguntas de pronunciación, go ahead. Teacher. Yes. Eh, ¿Cómo se pronuncia después de ghost? Don't, 
downstairs. Downstairs, downstairs. He goes downstairs. Él va a la, a la primera planta. Él baja las escaleras. He goes downstairs. Ok, upstairs es cuando subes a la, a la segunda planta, por ejemplo. Y downstairs es al bajar las escaleras. He goes downstairs. Teacher, eh, yes. light blue, donde Ajá. dice light ray o ray. Eh, let's see. He has two boys. Thomas, who is six years old, and Patrick, who is eight. They get dinner together in the dining room at around six. And after they spend time with their wife and kids at home, they really enjoy watching their favorite TV programs together. They really enjoy watching their favorite TV programs together. Teacher, qué complicado. Yeah. <laughs> it's not complicated. You can, yo porque se lo leo bien rápido, pero ahí... They really enjoy watching their favorite TV programs together. Together. Uh, together. 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 Okay. okay. Amarillo, pon atención. Yellows, listen. Yellows. Los amarillos, escuchen. Yellows, yellows. The next one. Yellows. Listen. Vamos a amarillos. Pongan atención. John's daily routine is a little boring, but he likes it. He usually gets up at about 6 or 6.30 in the morning. After his alarm clock wakes him up. First, he brushes his teeth and shaves and washes his face. Okay, los verdes, atentos, green ones. Then he gets dressed and goes downstairs to have breakfast with his family. He always has juice, cereal, and lots of fruits. That's him in the picture with his wife. Red ones, vamos a los rojos, 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 atención, rojos. Okay. ¿Dónde está Janet? Ok, rojo, rojo, rojos. Attention. He takes a bus to work because he doesn't like to drive. And he always arrives at his office before 8. 5 o'clock is his favorite time of the day because he finishes work and hurries back home and sees his wife and children again. Okay, like blues, buzos, buzos. He has two boys. Thomas, who is six years old, and Patrick, who is eight. They eat dinner together in the dining room at around six. And after that, he spends time with his wife and kids at home. They really enjoy watching their favorite TV programs together. And the pink ones, in addition, two or three times a week, he does exercise in the evening so he can stay strong and healthy. He thinks that this is very important. Finally, at about 9.30, he goes to bed, reads for a while, and then he falls asleep. Sure, some people think his daily routine is a little boring, but on weekends and holidays, he loves to fly airplanes for fun. It's his favorite hobby. Okay. Complicated? A little bit. Nivel de complicación del 1 al 10. 8. Okay, let me see. I am going to share with you again. Okay, let me send it here. And on the chat. There you have it in the chat on Zoom. Ahí se lo envía el chat de Zoom. 
and we are going to work on this one. We have five different groups. Edwin and who is the other light blue? Quien es el otro amarillo? Edwin and and yo. yo. Oye un yo, pero no me sale el nombrecito. Luz. Yo, 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 yo. Okay, Edwin and Luz. And here we have. Okay. Here. For number two, I have. Okay, who are number two? Green ones. ¿Quiénes son los green ones? Green, green, green. Ay. José. José and... What is the other green one? ¿Quién es el otro verde? José and... Ay. And Ilse. José and Ilse. Okay. Number three. We have the red ones. The red ones are Janet and Yo, Tatiana. And Tatiana. Okay. Vamos con los light blue. The light blues. Uh -huh. Me. Joanna and Alma. Uh -huh. Hola. Joanna uh -huh. and Alma and the pink ones. Yo. Catherine Me. and Leticia. Okay. Good. I am going to send you with your group to practice, okay? Lo voy a mandar con su otro del mismo color a que practique. Then when we come back, one of you is going to read, okay? Practice with your couple. Los dos tienen el mismo color, practique. Okay, so I am going to send the different colors here. And the last one. I will send the last one. Here. Okay. There you go. So all of them are practicing their part of the paragraph on their different groups. Let's go and see how they are doing.
¿Qué pasa? Hello. Hola. Ok. Hola. Ustedes van a practicar solo el amarillo. A los dos les tocó sí, lo mismo. Pero Ajá. Le estaba comentando a él que no tengo la imagen así sombreada. Que... Ah, no la que se que... las envía a todos al chat. En el chat de Zoom están. Pero no, a mí no me sale. Sí. Pero... Veamos. No te sale el chat aquí. No, no me sale. O sea, me meto al chat, pero no, no me sale nada. Ahí no le cayó un mensaje que yo acabo de mandar. Ahorita, eso sí, ahorita sí. Vale, en los otros les he enviado las fotitos. Pero no me sale. Pero okay. si da igual las de Facebook, ya sé dónde, hasta dónde llegamos. Ok, vamos desde John hasta Washes His Face, ¿ok? Ajá. Uh -huh. Sí, sí. Go ahead. Vaya. ¿Comienzo o que comience él? It's okay. No sé. Vaya, voy a comenzar yo a ver qué tal. Jones. Ojalá era daily, no sé. Daily, daily. Vaya, daily. Right. Jones daily routine is a little boring. But, but he likes it. But he likes he it. Used But, but he likes it. But, but he likes it. He usually get up gets, above gets six up. and get up at both about six or six sorry in the morning. After his alarm clock alarm clock. Alarm clock. Uh, weeks weeks. Wakes, 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 wakes him up first. He brush, brushes, no sé. He brushes, brushes. He brushes his teeth. Teeth, teeth. His teeth. His teeth and she shaves. Shave or chip. No, shaves. Shave. And watches his face. Washes. Washes. <laughs> washes. Washes. Washes his face. Okay. Okay, you say, remember the third person. La tercera persona tiene que estar bien marcada y se tiene que oír la S. You say like, but he likes it. He usually gets up. Wakes him up. Brushes. Right? Brushes his teeth. Brushes his teeth and shaves and washes his face. Okay, Edwin, léelo. John's daily routine is a little bone calling. He likes. He usually gets. He usually, usually. He usually get up. gets up. Gets up. At a bowl, six or six, thirty, 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 thirty in the morning. After his alarm, alarm clock wakes him up. Wakes him up. You know, first, first, first. first. First, uh -huh. he brushes. He brushes, brushes. Brushes. No, brushes. Oh, brushes. Brush. He brushes, brushes his teeth. And shave. shaves. Shave. Shaves. Shaves. Wash. Washes. His face. His face. Ok, practíquenlo, chicos. Ya le hice la corrección. Keep practicing. Ok. Keep practicing. Voy al siguiente grupo. Vaya, to have, to have breakfast. Mm -hmm. While his family, he always has used 
cereal and lots of fruit that's him in the picture why his wife ahora usted nuevamente okay listen Then. listen okay important listen carefully listen 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 it says then he gets dressed and then goes downstairs to have breakfast no breakfast right breakfast Bre to have breakfast with his family he always has juice cereal and lots of fruit that's him in the picture with his wife vamos him then he gets dressed and goes downstairs to have breakfast 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 of downstairs to have breakfast what his family with his family uh, with with his family o sea que aquí no cambia nada with his family oh. no with his family He always has you, cereal, and lots of fruit. That's he, that's him. That's him in the picture with his wife. Very good job. So now mm -hmm. try to make it a little bit more fluid, okay? Ahora practíquenlo para que le salga más fluido, okay? Then he gets dressed and goes downstairs to have breakfast with his family. He always has juice, cereal, and lots of fruits. That's him in the picture with his wife. Practice. Okay, practice, practice, and practice. I will come back. Siguen practicando, chicos. Okay. Okay. Yes, war and forage. But home and see his wife and children again. Okay, very good. Vamos, Janet, te toca. Eh, yo fui la primera. Ajá, vamos, vamos, vamos. He takes. Try. He takes. A bus. The world. The cause. He doesn't. He doesn't he like. He like to. Drive. 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 And, a, and he always are, and are he always office, arrives before night city o'clock. No, before the, eight. Before eight. It says eight he listen, listen, listen. Okay, escuchalo y de ahí me lo vas a repetir. <laughs> he takes a bus. He takes a bus to work because he doesn't like to drive. Vamos, repetilo conmigo. He takes a bus to work. No, he takes a bus to work because he doesn't like, he doesn't like to drive. To try. And he always, and he always arrives arrive at his office. His office at his office. At his office before eight. Before eight. Five o'clock. Five o'clock. Is his favorite time of the day. Okay. Is his favorite time of the day. Time of the day. The fight is today. Okay. Because he. Because he. Finishes. Finishes. Work. In. Work. And hurries. No, 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 no. Hurries. Hurry. Back Hurry. home. Back home. And sees. And sees. 
His wife and children again. No, his wife and children again. Again. Okay. Es que irlo practicando, Janet, así despacito, con las palabras bien articuladas. Ok, Tatiana, vamos, leamos. Go ahead. He takes a bus to work because he doesn't like to drive. And he always arrives at his office before eight. Five o'clock is his favorite time of the day because he finishes work and hurries back home and sees his wife and children again. Excellent job. Okay. Practice once again and we're going to come back. Practíquenlo una vez más. I will come back. Ah, de verdad. Hello. Hello, teacher. Uh -huh. Read it. I want to listen to you. I want to listen to you. Quiero escucharlo. Uh -huh. Okay. And he has Two boys, Thomas, where is this, your son, and um, Patrick, where is eight? Who is eight? Who is eight? Se me olvidó esa pronunciación y lo estuve Who? practicando. <laughs> Who is eight? They eat. Dinner together, 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 together in they in in the dining room. Hi, teacher. In the dining room. And Raúl and. Okay, they eat dinner together in the dining room. At around. At around. At around. Six. Six. Um, after. And after that. And after that. He spends. He, he spends. Time. Time. With his wife and kids at home. With his wife and kids wife at home. And kids um, home. at home. home. At home. And home. <laughs> they really enjoy. They really enjoy. Watching their favorite programs together. Watching their favorite TV programs together. Together. Together, together. Okay, Joanna, together. vamos. Together. Okay. Uh, he has two boys, Thomas, who is six years old, and, Pat and Patrick, who is eight. They eat dinner together and they dinner room at dining room in their dining room. In their dining dining their, room. There. In their their dining room at around six. And after that, he spends time with his wife and kids at home. They really enjoy watching the they they fight. Okay. Favorite. They, favorite. <laughs> favorite TV programs together. Okay. Yes. They really enjoy. Okay, it says they really enjoy watching their favorite, their favorite TV programs together, right? They are favorite TV programs together. It is complicated, but you did a very good job, right? Hicieron un muy buen trabajo a pesar de que es un párrafo bien complicado. 
So, practice one once more, okay? La última vez y nos vamos. Practice. De regresarnos a la sala. Ahorita. Here we go. I am here, okay? Yeah, it's because I was with the other groups, right? Venía de los otros grupos. So, go ahead. Read it. Vamos, lean su parte. Ah, ah. I lost it, you see. Go ahead. Ahorita. Lo voy a compartir, Lick. It's okay. Go ahead. Teacher, go ahead. Lo, lo voy a compartir. Ok, si no se los comparto yo ahorita, no voy. Ah, va, va. Ok. Ahorita, ahorita también. Ok. Here I go. And here I go, I go, I go, I go. Here. There you go. Uh, in addition in two or three times time a week, a week he, he does, does exercise, exercise in the evening. In the evening, so, so he, he can, can stay strong, strong and healthy. And he he thinks that, that this is very, very important. important. Finally, at about night, sorry, night sorry, he, he goes to bed, read, read for a, a while. while. And, and then, then finds as a sleep. Sure, sure. Some people, some people think in his dying time is a little bad, but, but on, on weekends, weekends and holidays, he loves he loves to fly, to fly airplane for fun. Is his his favorite, favorite hobby. hobby. What a beautiful paragraph! Wow. Hey, you were the only group who were coordinated. <laughs> El único grupo que sí se coordinó para leer. That was beautiful. <laughs> I love it. That was so nice. Thank you. And the longest paragraph. Thank you. Tenían yeah. el párrafo más largo. Yeah, sí. it was the longest Eso paragraph. Eso decíamos nosotros. <laughs> yeah, but you see, it was in the correct hands. Very good job. Excellent job. Let's go back to the main room. Fantastic. Ya Thank ven. you. Me espera Thank valió you. la pena. <laughs> <laughs> it was nice. Very, very beautiful <laughs> job. Nice job. Okay, welcome back. Hey, Leti, muy buen trabajo el que hicieron con Catherine. Muy bonito. Wow. Thank it, you, it, it was... Nos coordinamos. No, pero nos was... coordinamos a practicar primero una, después la otra, después juntas. That was very good. Congratulations. <laughs> wow. I, I am I am very surprised. Very nice. It was really <laughs> Definitely. It was very good. Well, Thank so you. we are going to work on this part today. So for the, okay, let's go here. Thank you very much, everybody, for being here, being back. Ah, today you have been practicing a lot, okay? Ahora la clase, ustedes fueron los protagonistas de la clase. Yo solo le di indicaciones. Esto, 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 esto. And then you were producing and talking and talking and talking and talking. Hoy sí los he hecho hablar y hablar y hablar y hablar. Hoy no hemos escrito nada. Casi nada. Escribimos poquito. Pero hoy se han hablado un montón. So, we are going to cover here. The main thing about today was the daily routines. Si se fijan, todo lo relacionado a John, it's a daily routine. Habla de su rutina diaria. ¿Qué hace él durante todo el día? 
So that was about the daily activities, ¿ok? Me basé en esta parte de su manual que decía acerca de las actividades diarias, pero no era solo las de ustedes, sino que se las quise llevar un poquito más allá, ¿ok? With the daily activities, igual este día lo comenzamos con preguntas. And this is the form of the questions. You have it on your manual, right? Does she ask for assistance? Yes, she does. No, she does. Does he drive the truck on weekends? Does Elena make phone calls? Does your company check the policies? Yes, it does. No, it doesn't, right? And to create the questions, right? Creamos preguntas al principio de la clase. And we are going to just wrap up this with the question. Yes, he does. He fixes the AC on Friday. For this case, we say like, does he fix the AC on Friday? Okay, como las preguntas que hicimos al principio de la clase. Esta es la oración principal. He fixes the AC on Friday. ¿Cómo la transformamos en pregunta? Agregándole does. Does he fix, y como ya le pusimos does, el verbo queda normal, ¿ok? Si tenemos esta respuesta aquí, ¿cómo sería la pregunta? Agregándole does. So you say, does she send many emails to customers? ¿Qué tal la otra? Does she Does the first she clean? Only. Okay, and what about this one? Eric keeps track of the sales. Does does Eric, Eric keep, keep track of the sales? Okay, and for the answers in this type of questions, when they start with do or does, we say yes or no. Does she ask for assistance? Yes, she do. Yes, she does. No, she doesn't, right? We only have the two options of answers, yes or no, okay? And this is what we did yesterday, right? Ayer hicimos esto de las profesiones, que era lo que cada profesión hacía. And for sure, today we work on my partner's daily routine. That was in the case of John, okay? Así que... A mí siempre me gusta mostrarles de dónde he sacado los ejercicios para su clase, ¿ok? Porque esto lo sentí un poquito básico. Yo dije, no, estos chicos los voy a llevar un poquito más arriba. And, y ahí apareció Mr. John on the stage, ¿ok? It's when Mr. John appeared. It was a very nice practice for this. I need one yellow to give me the first paragraph. One yellow, please. Who? Which yellow? Edwin or Luz? ¿Quién lo va a leer? Yo. Okay, yo. <laughs> yo. Go ahead. <laughs> que se prepare un verde, que se prepare un rojo, que se prepare un celeste y un rosa. Vamos. Edwin, action. John, daily routine is a little boring, but he likes. He usually has up at about 6 or 6.30 in the morning. After his alarm clock, wakes him up. First, he brushes his teeth and shaves. Shaves. And shaves. En washes his face. Ajá, un verdecito que continúe. Then, he got dressed and goes downstairs to have breakfast with his family. He always has few cereal and lots of fruit. That's him in the picture with his wife. Thank you. The red one. Tati, go. He takes a bus to work because he doesn't like to drive and he always arrives at his office before eight. Five o'clock is his favorite time of the day 
because he fin finishes work and hurries back home and sees his wife and children again. A light blue? Cat, the boy, Thomas, who is this, your soul, and Patrick, who is a, they, they eat dinner together, in, they, dining room, dining room, Dining room of, of at around six and after they no, sign he is paying sign with his wife with his wife and kids. At home. At home, they really enjoy. 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 Watching. 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 Their favorite TV programs together. Okay. Y las chicas rosa. Barbie moment. One, two, three. In addition, in to, the or addition to or three, or three times, times a week, a week he, he does, does exercise, exercise in, the in the evening so he, so can, he stay can stay strong and he thinks think that, that this is, is very, very important. important. Finally, at about, at about night, night sorry, he, he goes, goes to bed, to bed read read for a while, a while and then find a sleep. Sure, sure. Some, Some people think his daily routine is, is a little boring, but, but on, on weekends weekend and holidays, holiday, he loves to fly, to fly airplane for, for fun. It is his favorite hobby. Excellent job, my dear class. A clap for everybody. There's an applause of thoughts. You did a very excellent job on this exercise. Congratulations. Wow. Congratulations. Practice makes perfection. ¿Qué es lo único que tienen que hacer con el inglés? Quítenle el miedo. Gran miedo que le tenían. Miren ahora. Este es un párrafo bastante avanzado para... 12 días de inglés. So, el único miedo vive aquí arriba. Y si lo sacan de ahí, van a hacer grandes cosas con el idioma. Have a wonderful night. I am going to see you tomorrow for your next class. Bye bye, my dear students. You did a beautiful bye job bye. today. Hola, teacher. See you tomorrow. Bien orgulloso de ustedes ahora. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.